Vanessa here from the Newport Public Library on the beautiful Oregon coast. I'm here with Pongo and we are so excited to tell you a story today. Pongo, what's our story about? Bears? Yeah, bears. What else? Chairs? Yeah, and chairs and, and anything else? Sizes! <laughs> You're right. So, do you want to hear a story? Yeah, I want to hear Goldilocks and the one, two, three bears. All right, let's hear a story. Once upon a time in a faraway land, there lived a little girl called Goldilocks because her hair shone like gold. One day, she started off into the forest and she ended up lost. But just ahead of her, there stood a snug little house in which three bears lived. They were the big papa bear, the medium-sized mama bear, and the wee little baby bear. They had gone out on a walk into the forest, waiting for their porridge to cool. Goldilocks found the door unlocked. In the kitchen, three bowls of porridge. First, she tasted the largest bowl, which belonged to the big papa bear. It was too hot. Then she tasted the middle-sized bowl, which belonged to the medium-sized bear. It was too cold. Then she tasted the smallest bowl, which belonged to the littlest bear. It was just right, and she ate every bit. Yum! Next, she went to the living room, and there stood three chairs. She tried the biggest chair, but it was too tall. She tried the medium-sized chair, but it was too wide. Then she tried the little chair, it was just right, and she sat so hard, she broke it. By this time, Goldilocks was very tired, so she climbed the stairs where she found three beds. She tried the largest bed, but it was too hard. She tried the medium-sized bed, but it was too soft. She tried the smallest bed, and it was just right, so she lay down and fell asleep. Now, while Goldilocks was sleeping soundly, the three bears came home from their walk, and they went straight to the kitchen to get their porridge. The big papa bear went to his bowl and growled, Someone's been tasting my porridge! Someone's been tasting my porridge! Someone has tasted my porridge, and they've eaten every bit! And then all three went into the living room, and big papa bear growled, Someone's been sitting in my chair! Someone's been sitting in my chair. Someone's been sitting in my chair and they broke it all to pieces. And so they all went upstairs. Big Bear growled. Someone's been sleeping in my bed. Someone's been sleeping in my bed. Someone's been sleeping in my bed and she's still here. Goldilocks woke up with a fright. She saw three bears standing over the bed, so she jumped up and ran out of the house just as fast as her legs could carry her. And she learned never, ever go into a house that isn't yours. And that was the story of Goldilocks and the three bears. That was so much fun. I loved it. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> and what did you learn today? I learned never go into a stranger's house. That's right, good job. All right, well, Pongo and I have to go, so we'll see you again real soon. Say goodbye, Pongo. Goodbye. <laughs>